Hello and welcome back to My Magic 2 Gates to Another World. So I looked up at uh, what I still need to do in order to get the rest of the uh, stat bonuses. And apparently I missed two of them that are pretty much obvious to get. So that's what I'll be trying to do now. Uh, we're currently in Atlantium and uh, we actually haven't even been to the cavern below Atlantium. Which, knowing this town, I suspect will be brutal, but uh, we'll see how that goes, I suppose. And the cavern is simply here. No need to fight anything. Also, since it's darkness, I... Wait a minute... Wait a minute. I remember giving the Amber Skull and Topaz Shard to people. So... what gives? Well, I suppose you'll just have to bear with me and see how this works normally. I don't usually record things like that, but hey, <laughs> every once in a while it might be interesting to see. So, basically, Legolas is full now. I need to remove the gauntlet plus two. Then I think Firefly doesn't have any, yeah, so give it to him. Trade item with six. You're not Legolas. You're Legolas. <laughs> Trade item with six. The might gauntlets. And now you can equip them. Why Firefly? Because everyone else are already full. <laughs> I need to give Legolas the Tobas shard. Trade item with 5B and equip F. And now his accuracy is through the roof. And for Amber Skull, thankfully Gandalf has more than enough space. So simply trade item 8A, equip D. And there we go. Also, the reason why I looked at my inventory is that I want to use the starch. You see. Because why waste spell points? <laughs> okay, so we're in the dungeon right now. Uh, where do we start exactly? Somewhere in the middle. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay, I see where I need to go. Basically, <laughs> it's like following a maze. You have to look at this wall and follow this wall. No entry. Well, nuts to you, sign. Private, keep out. Okay. Private, keep out. Okay. And... Yes. Follow the wall. Private, keep out. Well, nuts to you, sign. Again. Oh. So, here's the local thief guild. Uh, I didn't think that Atlantium, of all things, would have that, but I suppose they do have a prison. So, they need to have thieves in order to put them into prison, I suppose. <laughs> uh, but I really, really hope that they don't steal things, because that would be awful. And they shoot. Uh-huh. Good to know. First of all, you're dead. Yeah, this isn't quite as bad as I thought it would be. Fight B. Shoot C. Uh, heal someone. I suppose for a fly I could use some. Or not. Wow, he has really low hit points. That was a waste of spell points. Arg. <laughs> okay, but he can cast... Uh, burr, I forgot, actually. Uh, which one is that? 5-2, uh, okay. Deadly Swarm. And that should take care of some of them. Double kill! Yeah?
And your truant can attack. Gandalf, on the other hand, should cast Air Shield. 4 5. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, come on! That was not fair in the slightest. But okay. Oh, really? Fight be then. Thief is backstabbed. <laughs> okay, Boromir, you can um, fight B as well. Huh, there's a free thief there. Uh, but I'll shoot G first. And then Frodo, you can now heal someone worthwhile, like Gertrude. Oh yeah, speaking of Gertrude... She has an intellect of zero! She's as stupid as an orc, if not as stupid as a plant. <laughs> uh, okay, so, Friarfly, uh, do your thing. Not bad. But probably no other kills, just softening them up, generally. Okay, Gertrude. Attack. Gandalf. Cast a fireball. Because, uh... Because there's a high chance that it will knock out one of the thieves. And a dead. Two even. Double kill. And that is maximum efficiency. Good. Ow. 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 Right. Attack. Attack. Another backstab. And 90 points of damage. That's kind of overkill. Okay, um... Attack as well. Oh. Shoot I. Then heal. Heal Boron there. <coughs> Test another swarm. That should be highly effective. Or not. It's almost as if it froze. <laughs> okay, uh... Fight B. And cast... Another fireball on G. Oh, come on! That was still better than a lightning bolt. And now they wait for an opening, for some reason. Except for the last thief. That's something that really puzzles me. Why sometimes they skip their turn and sometimes they shoot? Is it random or is it dependent on something? Huh. Anyway, Aragorn, you need to fight B, I guess? Fight B. Fight B. Shoot B. Oh, come on! He heal. Wow, Gandalf. Okay, and then... This still warrants deadly swarm. Should be good to go now. Double kill. Multi-kill. You can fight E. And this is a good opportunity for a lightning bolt. Double kill. Multi kill. 
and the last thief goes down. Oh, that's a lot of experience. Didn't expect the kind of Spanish Inquisition. I'm also find trap, Shagrath. Holy cow! How much gold will you give me? And an ascetic sword plus sex. I want to look up what it does. Ascetic sword. Knight, paladin, archer, robber. Acid plus 15. I suppose that means resistant to acid? Uh, let me see. Yeah, resistance. So it's just resistance to acid. Special power is 3-1 from Sorcerer's Arsenal. Um, acid stream. 2-3 damage per level on one monster. Not particularly that useful, but can be more useful as time goes, because it doesn't use spell points. And deals 10 damage, which is an equivalent to Battle Axe and Broadsword, which are like the best weapons ever. And it's plus 6 too, which means that... I'm not actually sure if that also increases the equipment bonus or not. Hmm. Plus six is the same thing as we have already, so <laughs> that acid resistance will be quite useful. I'll give this to someone. But anyway, what we are here for is not acidic swords or a lot of money. But rather, Harikari and no name can be found simply sitting around in the cavern under Vulcania at 114. Yeah, already found them. <laughs> They're simply sitting around. It's look. It really looked to me like they were kind of stuck. <laughs> but anyway, um. Yes, this is solid, this isn't. And that's actually the only way to get to this place. And here we have... A statue of a renowned scholar kneels with a book in hand. Read pages? Yes. After reading the pages, you are enlightened. And that gave us... Intellect? Question mark. Uh, yes, that's plus ten to intellect. Cross the board. <laughs> Except, of course, Gertrude still shows up as having zero intellect because we still need to rest for that to take effect. Uh, but otherwise. I don't think the Atlantium Dungeon has anything else of particular value. There are some traps, some encounters, some notes... There are some hints. I might want to visit those. Uh, but for now, I definitely want to save, so... Um, I fly. Do the magic, literally. <laughs> and let's save. Save. And I suppose we can rest. And now Gertrude has an intellect of ten. Good. <laughs> She's no longer stupid as an orc. Then recast that. Legless, you can cast protection from magic, and Boromir, you can cast protection from forces. Right, so let's uh, explore this area a bit more, shall we? Uh, 
use a torch again. And we've explored that much. I want to explore something else as well. Uh, yes. Okay. So let's go forward here. This is private keep out. Okay. This is private keep out. No. Oh, mutants. Mutants. Yeah, if I recall correctly, they are kind of horrible to deal with. Because they're not mutant swine, but actually kind of strong enemies, but not something uh, too special, if I recall correctly, as well. Just strong enemies. So, of course, I want to spread the damage as much as I can, if I be. Oh, only three openings, that's pretty good. Cast Bless, Cast Deadly Swarm, the only thing I don't really like about... Uh, is it? I think it's 5-2 actually. Uh, one thing that I don't like about Deadly Swarm is how it's, since it makes everyone hurt, uh, makes it a bit harder to see which enemies were hurt prior to that and which weren't. Also, my gosh, that's a lot of en that's a lot of resistance and energy blasts everywhere. Wow, that went poorly. We still have 19 mutants here and they're magic resistant and we're getting slaughtered. Oh boy. So Gertrude, you can, you can fight D. Gandalf. You should cast. Uh, no, the thing is that if I could cast. Uh, people mind on them. This could be made a lot easier, uh, but I'm not sure if I want to do that. Another thing is that I could use Disrupt and... Uh, well, no, actually, they're magic resistant. Yeah, that's going to be a problem. So, cast invisibility for now. Okay, you can attack. Shagrath, attack. Boromir. Oh, he is now in the front row. Fight E then. <clears throat> Frodo, Power Cure, Legolas, Firefly. Cast another deadly swarm. Okay, that worked. But still not as well as I planned. Yeah, we're still kind of dead. Fight C. Gandalf, okay, you can try a uh, fireball this time around. On. Uh, on F, yeah. Okay, mutants don't take well to fireballs, good to know. Aragorn, fight. Uh, just attack. Attack. Whoa, <laughs> fuck! 100 points of damage, that's amazing. Okay, Boromir. Attack. 11 mutants still left. This is going to be horrible. Shoot F. 
Now I no longer have the luxury of uh, casting mass spells, I do believe. I need to focus on curing everyone and fast. Because this is not going well. Uh, Shagrath, sure. It's a bit overkill, but I need it. Otherwise, we're not making back live. At all. Okay, Gertrude. Fighty. Gandalf. We'll try a lightning bolt then. On F. They don't take kindly to lightning bolts either. Good to know. Good to know. Attack. Attack. Fight. E. Shoot. F. Power cure on Boromir. And simply... What? I said simply heal Gandalf. Ow, ow, ow. Ow. Oh, come on! Well, at least they didn't kill him. Attack. Attack. And fight E. Attack. Shoot F. Then uh, power cure on Gandalf. Then power cure on Legolas. More and more openings. No! Gosh darn mutants. Uh, yeah, this is not going to go well. Even if only six mutants are left out of the field, it's still way too much. You can't sustain this too much longer, so... Uh, Fight E. Then Gandalf. What can you do? Well, of course, the obvious thing is time distortion, but I don't really care enough to cast that, especially since Boromir is now dead. Well, I could try Feeble Wind. Cast for two on G. G? It works on five monsters, so might as well enough. Oh. Well. Well. That wasn't very useful. Aragorn. Just attack. Shagrath. Just attack. Legolas. Shoot. F. Frodo. Power Cure. Gandalf. And Firefly, you can heal Shagrath. But, but he was already dead. Wasn't he? No! Yeah, this is not going well. Oh wow, one shot. Not bad. Okay, Gandalf, what can you do then? Um... Web? Question mark? 
Well, let's try that. Four monsters, huh? Three, five. On G. Nope, doesn't seem to be effective. Attack. Attack. No, actually, fight E. Then shoot F. Power cure on Frodo. Not that it will help that much. And Legolas is dead. Or Aragorn. No, somehow everyone survived. Attack. <clears throat> Gandalf. You're useless. Yep, you're useless. Well, you can just try and cast Fingers of Death, 5-2, on F, but I doubt that will be successful at all. And Shagrath, attack. Yes, we have less mutants on the screen. So who do I save first? Legolas or Aragorn? I guess Aragorn. And then Legolas. Firefly doesn't have a lot of hit points as it is as well. Also, someone's messaging me. Well, whatever. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, Gandalf, um, I don't think you can do anything more special than what I said you could. Thing is, this rope would probably be more useful in this case. Even though it will fail most of the time as well, but hey. It worked! <laughs> That's all that matters. Okay, so... Aragorn, you can fight. Actually, fight A, yeah. I need to get rid of as many mutants as I can right now. Legolas. What? 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 How did I get into this menu? There's no such thing as pressing D. I pressed D by accident. <laughs> okay, Legolas, you can attack. Well, that was anticlimactic. Okay, Frodo, then you can uh, cast another power cure on your true Shagrath. Very Shagrath, of course. And then her fly can follow up on Gertrude. Okay, let's hope nobody dies. Well, Gertrude may be down, but she's not dead. And nobody else is affected. Okay. So Gandalf, you can continue with that. Maybe it will work again. Highly doubt it. But you never know. Oh no. Wow, that worked out. Splendid. Okay, Aragorn, um, attack. Good job. Shograth, attack. Good job. Legolas, Dark, good job! I think we may just make it. With one death, but we have more than enough money to make up for that. And we'll probably earn enough money 
in this case as well. Unless they have nothing on them. Okay, Frodo, of course, Power Cure and Gertrude. No questions there. And uh, Firefly, Power Cure, nine hit points, and four spell points. Oh well, back to standard healing. Heal yourself. Uh, this is really close. Even with four mutants, they can wreck us very easily. We need to focus on single enemies now. Uh, 5-1 again on B. Failed, okay. Aragorn, attack. Okay, three left. That's good news. Frodo, you need to heal Shagrath. Yes, you still have spell points, that's good. Shagrath. Firefly, you need to heal Aragorn first. Oh no! This is really, really close. Two mutants left, but we are nearly out of spell points and uh, hit points as well. Attack, 60 points of damage, that should bring them down. Yes, and only one of them is left. So, whatever happens, they can't kill us. Okay, but still, yeah, not enough points. 2 1 on 7 then. And attack. No, oh, not even affected. Okay. Phew. Wow, that's a lot of experience, but I suppose we deserve it. Oh boy. Bronze chest. The last thing I want for it is to blow up on us, but what. Can I do? <laughs> what? What? Power club plus four? What? Power club. Might plus three. Everyone can use it and it deals six damage. Not interesting in the slightest. The only person who might be remotely interested in that is our sorcerer, but uh, Gandalf already has a pretty good staff. So, yeah, thanks, but no thanks. <clears throat> However, I need to rest. Gandalf, you have more than enough spell points, actually. Uh... Let me see, where are my spells? I need shelter, 5-4. And rest. Good. Now, Shagrath, use the torch again. And the reason why I went here is because there's something here. If time enough is spent in the elemental plane of air, Square 114 should be seen for encasement purposes. Aha. Uh -huh. So that's where you get... Air encasement, I guess. Alright, so let's just go back up. And save. Oh, it's night again. And it's D64. Alright, so that will be that. I will see you all next time once we go into a yet another... Actually, we'll probably finish this dungeon. And we'll go to another dungeon, maybe. So, see you all then. Later.